All right, y'all. Peace and blessings. God bless you all. I'm Jarvis Kingston, and I hope that y'all doing all right, staying strong and solid in these times that we're in. I pray that you have repented and that you are baptized. I pray that you are safe, protected, and prayed up. And I just pray that whatever situation that you're going through, that the Lord is with you, that he guides you, protects you, and looks out for you. He comforts you. I pray that your mental health gets better and that you become more strong and wise in the Lord. I pray that you keep fighting the good fight of faith. You keep running your race. You keep your eyes fixed on the Messiah. You keep your eyes fixed on the prize. You stay on that narrow straight gate path and you help out plenty of people along your journey forevermore. Amen. Always remember that the Lord will never leave you nor forsake you and that the Messiah intercedes for you. The spirit intercedes for you. So always stay thankful, grateful, appreciative, and take it one day at a time. Most definitely, let us thank the Lord for another day. Let us thank the Lord for giving us another day to seek his face. Let us thank the Lord for food in our belly, clothes in our back, and a roof over our head. Let us thank the Lord for protecting us coming in and going out. Guiding us through the morning, getting us through the afternoon, getting us through the evening, getting us through the nights. He is constantly looking out for us with his grace, mercy, favor, love, the outstretched arm of God, the mighty hand of God, the finger of God, his word, his only begotten son died for our sins. There's so much things the Lord has done for us throughout our lifetime and continues to keep doing for us because his mercy endures forever. His truth is everlasting. Amen. So always worship him. Always thank him. Always keep him first. Always praise him. Always trust him in everything you got going on in your life forever. Amen. Most definitely. Welcome, everyone. I appreciate all of you for listening and supporting. It means a lot to me. I love you all. Praying for you all. Let us always uplift each other in Christ and encourage each other in the Lord. Let us always pray for each other and to see for one another, comfort each other, support each other. All those great, awesome, amazing things. Brothers and sisters of the faith all over the world, let us be together on one accord for the Lord. Amen. Much love to the 12 tribes of Israel scattered all four corners of the earth, all the scattered Israelites among the nations, all ends of the earth. Much love to all the churches and mysteries out there with the sound doctrine, the peace, the love, the harm, the fellowship, and the services. Much love to all the previous martyrs, current martyrs, and future martyrs, the brave, bold, isolated, courageous believers who are going through it for the gospel, who are being persecuted for the faith, who are going through many tribulations for his namesake. Stay strong and encouraged. We are with you. Much love to the great tribulation saints down the road. Much love to all the grafted in Gentiles of all nations, tribes, languages, tongues, races, faces, kindreds all over the world. Much love to all the brand new creatures in Christ, all the brand new converts out there. Anyone who just became a believer, God bless you. Anyone who just repented, God bless you. Anyone who just got baptized, God bless you as well. Much love to all you new creatures in Christ out there, all you people who have a brand new life. If you did not repent, if you did not get baptized, go repent and get baptized ASAP immediately. Most definitely, shalom, family, greetings to all of you. Welcome everybody, all peoples, all nations, all tribes, all languages, all tongues, all races, all faiths, all kindreds, everybody. Let everything that has breath, praise the Lord. All the animals, all the creatures, all the beasts, all the fish in the sea, the birds in the air, the trees, the plants, the mountains, let all of God's creation praise him. Amen. Whether you are an Israelite or a Gentile, it is all right. Whether you are chosen or adopted, grafted in, it is all right. Let us gather together and praise the most high. Sing a new song, clap our hands, stomp our feet, praise him. Rejoice, always rejoice. Make a joyful noise, make a joyful sound, cry to him, dance, play an instrument, express yourself. Do what you have to do for the most high. He is always watching us, so always serve him with gladness and joy and always worship in spirit and truth. Amen. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. Love the Lord your God for all your might, heart, soul, strength, and might. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. Love the Lord your God for all your might, heart, soul, strength, and might. Let us love our neighbors as we love ourselves. And let us keep doing Father's business and Father's will for the rest of our lives till the sun comes back. Amen. He has come back like a thief in the night in a twinkling of an eye. He has come back at an hour nobody knows but the Father. Let us be ready, alert, sober, vigilant, prayed up, watchful. Let us be washed by the water, by the word, the washing of the water through the word. Let us keep our lamp in oils. Let us stay in our purpose and call for the most high God. Let us know the Lord better. Let's get more close to him. Let's seek his face. Draw near to God and he will draw near to you. Let us obey the gospel. Let us obey the laws that your commandments. Let us obey all of God's word. Anything the most high has told us personally according to our life, our calling, our purpose, our situation, our gifts, handle it, people. And constantly keep it all together for him, y'all. Keep it all together for him. The faith, the word of God, the law, statutes, commandments, decrees, precepts, ordinances, covenants, promises, judgments, the faith, the gospel. Keep everything together. Write a copy of the Torah. Copy everything from Genesis all the way through Deuteronomy. Keep keep a copy of the Torah. Amen. Most definitely. And just take it one day at a time, people, with your purpose, your calling. Keep doing a great commission. Keep winning souls. Keep leading people to the Messiah and show them that he, show people that he really is the way to the life. Amen. All right, so in today's message, what I will do is just go through this commentary, and then from there, I will close out with a prayer. I will close out with a priestly blessing. I will close out giving all the praise, honor, and glory to the Most High God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, and praise His only begotten Son who died for our sins. Amen. 
So this commentary is sort of like a point of view interview flashback type of scenario, as if you're interviewing Judas, the one who betrayed the Messiah. Obviously, we know the scripture says how he betrayed him for 30 uh, silver coins and um, also how he basically also scripture describes how the devil entered him as well to betray him. Okay, so this is like an interview type of format. Interview with Iscariot Judas. Judas Iscariot betrayed him. Mark chapter three, verse 19. Our readers want to know why you did it, why you betrayed the Messiah. Your readers ought to ask themselves whether they know why anybody does anything. Did you do it for the money? 30 silver coins isn't much money. A peasant makes that just by showing up for a month and slouching around the place. Any man who suggests that I can be brought so cheaply only shows that he has the mind of a peasant. Did you hope to force Jesus to act as the Messiah? I've heard that one too, as if you could force that man to do anything. When Messiah comes, he will not waste our time telling a lot of women about bread coming from the sky. Then you were disappointed with the Messiah. Disappointed? What can you expect from people anyway? They creep around serving their own petty self-interest. The man who expects nothing for them from them is never disappointed. You have been accused of stealing. You dare to talk about me stealing? What is it about stealing for a woman to take pure nard and rub it on the feet of some rabbi? 300 denaries might have gone to the poor. That is stealing. I didn't steal. I diverted funds to better purposes. Besides, the poor wouldn't know what to do with money if you gave it to them. Do you feel remorse for what you did? You asked that because I gave the 30 coins back. I cursed the priest's money. I flung it at their feet. I cut all ties with all ineffectual fools. But you did take your own life. I told you I cut all ties. Back to the future. Judas did not recognize who Jesus was. How is your life impacted by the fact that you do know who Jesus is? And what ways are you different from those who don't know Jesus? When have you been tempted to betray Jesus or to downplay his importance to you? What steps can you take to cultivate a heart that cares more about what Jesus thinks than about what other people think? Read Judas' story. For more on this story, see the book of Matthew chapter 27, verses 1 through 10. The book of Mark chapter 14, verses 1 through 11. And also verses 43 through 50. Also the book of John chapter 6, verse 58 through 71. The book of John chapter 13, verses 21 through 30. And also the book of Acts chapter 1, verses 15 through 20. So this is like an interview format to try to see what was going through his mind when he betrayed him, you know. So um, betrayal was a part of the Messiah's prophecy and uh, David said in the Psalms as well. So the Messiah came to live out the law, prophets, and Psalms throughout his lifetime, throughout his ministry. And it just shows how these situations could play out the way it does and how God still controls everything. Amen. So that is the commentary, all right? What I love to do as I close out is give all the praise, honor, and glory to the Most High God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. And praise is only begotten soon die for our sins. Amen. Hallelujah. So here we go. Hallelujah, praise him. He is the most high God of heaven and earth. He is the God of Shem, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob. He is the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob forever. He is the God of Israel. He's the God of Jeshurun. He's the God of the Hebrews. He is the God of Noah, Job, and Daniel. Praise him. His only begotten son died for our sins and rose up three days later. Must up to the Messiah for shedding his blood for all of us. He is the last Adam, the second Adam. Praise the Lord, the advocate. Hallelujah, praise him. The almighty, true, living God. Praise the Lord, the Alpha and Omega. Amen. The apostle of our profession, the arm of the Lord, the atoning sacrifice for our sins, the author and finisher of our faith, the author and perfecter of our faith, the author of life, the author of salvation, the beginning and the end, the beginning of creation of God, the beloved son, the blessed and only potent, the blessed and only ruler, the blessed and only sovereign, the branch, the bread of God, the bread of life, the bridegroom, the capstone, the captain of salvation, the chief cornerstone, the chief shepherd, Christ, the Christ of God, the constellation of Israel, the cornerstone, the counselor, wonderful counselor, the creator, the day spring, the deliverer, the desire of the nations, the door, the elect of God, Emmanuel, Emmanuel, God is with us, eternal life, everlasting father, faith and true witness, faithful and true, the faithful witness, the first and last, the first begotten, the firstborn from the dead, firstborn over all creation, the forerunner, the gate, the glory of the Lord, God, the good shepherd, the great high priest, the great shepherd, the glory of the Lord, the head of the church, the hair of all things, the high priest, holy and true, the holy one, the hope, the hope of glory, the horn of salvation, the I am, the 
the I am that I am, the I am who I am, the great I am, the image of God, Jehovah, 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 Jireh, Jehovah, Shalom, Jehovah, Nassai, Jesus of Nazareth, Jesus, the judge of Israel, the judge, King eternal. He is the king of Israel. Amen. He is the king of kings. Hallelujah. He is the king of kings and Lord of lords. Hosanna, Hosanna, the highest praise. Hosanna, the son of David. Blessed be he that comes in the name of the Lord. We have blessed you out of the house of the Lord. King of saints, king of the ages, king of the Jews, the king, the lamb, the lamb of God, the lamb without blemish, the last Adam, the lawgiver, the leader and commander, the life, the life of the world, the lion of the tribe of Judah, the living one, the living stone, the Lord, the Lord, our righteousness, the Lord is holiness, the Lord is my battle, the Lord is my portion, my strength, my rock, my refuge, my good fortress, my high time, my shield, my buckler, my strength, my song, my safety, my defense, my deliverer, my redeemer, my salvation, our provider, hallelujah, praise him. Yah, Yahweh, Yahuwah, Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Be Yahweh, Ahai Yeshai, Yeshua HaMashiach, Barakatha Shalom Shalom, Yeshua Elohim, Yehosha, Yehusha, Yehosha, Ahai Yeshai, Adonai, Abba. He is the consuming fire. He is the father of heavenly lights, the father of the fatherless, the father of widows, the father of mercies. He is the God of heaven and earth. His son is at the right hand of him. The government rests on his shoulders. He is the great physician who can heal all things. He is the carpenter who can fix all things. With God, all things are possible. Nothing is too hard for the Lord. God made everything in six days and rest on the seventh day. You can fix your situation right now in the name of Jesus. We touch and agree, y'all. Call on him. He'll show you great, mighty things. Search and seek him with all your heart and you will find him. He is a rewarder to those who seek him diligently. Know that he exists. Believe in him. Trust in him. Know he could do for you. Abide in him and abide in his word. Ask the Father what you need in the Son's name that shall be given to you. Healing, restoration, deliverance, miracles, signs, wonders, help, comfort, unexpected good news, unexpected blessings. Praise him. Yes, your faith has made you well. Your faith has saved you your faith has blessed you your faith is how you're justified your faith is how you overcome the world hallelujah we know that for the rest of our lives the outstretched arm of god will be in our lives forever the mighty hand of god will be in our lives forever the finger of god will be on our lives forever yes we are in agreement with the father son holy spirit god is one he is with us forever people he got us he is the Lord of all, the Lord of glory, the Lord of lords, the man from heaven, the man of sorrows, the mediator of the new covenant. We walk by faith and not by sight. The just shall live by faith for sure. He is the mediator of the new covenant, the mediator, the message of the covenant, the Messiah, the mighty God, the mighty one, the morning star, the Nazarene, the offspring of David, the only begotten son of God, our great God and savior, our holiness, our husband, our Passover, our protection, our redemption, our righteousness, our sacrifice, the Passover lamb, the power of God, the precious cornerstone, the prince of kings the prince of life, the prince of peace, the prophet, the redeemer, the resurrection of life, the resurrection, the resurrected of life, the revelation, the revelator, the righteous branch, the righteous one, the radiant one, the perfect example, the rock, the root of David, the rose of Sharon, the ruler of God's creation, the rule of the kings of the earth, the savior, the seed of woman, the shepherd and bishop of souls, the Shiloh, the son of Abraham, the son of David, the son of God, the son of man, son of the blessed, son of the most high God, the source of eternal salvation for all who obey him, the son of righteousness, the just one, the one mediator the stone the builders rejected the true bread the true god the true light the true vine he is the truth amen he is the way hallelujah he is the way truth of life praise him the wisdom of god the witness the wonderful counselor the word the word of god the word of life the word of yahuwah the word of elohim the word made flesh the living word most definitely his word is pure, fine, silver, just as David said in Psalms. Every word of God is true, pure, flawless, as the book of Proverbs says. And we know that his words are double edged as the book of Hebrew says. Amen. We touch and agree. He is the high priest of the order of Melchizedek. He is the sinless high priest. He's the everlasting king. He's the way everlasting. Praise him always forever. Prayers up for all the poor people. Prayers up for all the widows, the orphans, all the fatherless. Prayers up for the tribe of Levi. Prayers up for the strangers, the sojourners, the refugees, the pilgrims. Prayers up for all peoples, all walks of life, the babies, the children, the young boys, the young girls, the teenagers, the young men, the young women, middle-aged people, senior citizens, elders. Prayers up for all the elders, all the single people, married people, divorced people, widowed people. Prayers up for all of you and all your conditions, people, all right? Prayers up always forever, everybody, most definitely. Let us repent and get baptized. Let us circumcise our hearts before the Lord our God. Let us be blameless before the Lord our God. Let us forgive others so that the Heavenly Father can forgive us as well. Let the Lord use us in these last days that we're in. Amen. Most definitely. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debt doors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the honor and the glory forever. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. And they shall put my name on the children of Israel and I will bless them. Shalom.
Amen. Selah, Barakatha. I'm Jarvis Kingston. I love you all. Praying for you all. Peace.